I guess in this video lecture, I'm going to discuss what how to run Jupyter Notebook in PyCharm. So let's open the PyCharm. So first, uh, right click on this project. So first, you need to create any project related with the uh, Python. Then select here new. Then here you can see Jupyter Notebook is there. So you need to click this on this Jupyter Notebook. Let's give the meaningful uh, name of this Jupyter Notebook. So here, py app. Press enter. So uh, here you can see this uh, py app that's come there and this place you can uh, give any code. So I already have the code related with the uh, Python. So this is the code here to add to number paste inside there. Now after that here you can see this run cell and debug cell option is there and run all. So let's click on this run cell option and uh, here you can see or uh, this come there run cell so this asking about to enter first number let's enter 6 and let's enter 8 so here you can see the sum of 6 and 8 is or uh, 14 that's uh, displaying or uh, this places now the next is here or uh, let's uh, use this code pandas code so pandas programming that's going to run inside there so here you can see pandas or uh, there is the problem install missing driver let's install this driver or uh, this tools uh, package we need to install here you can see installing packages so for this one it must be connected then after uh, you can run the pandas program inside the jupyter notebook so this is the python code and now going to uh, start running pandas code so here this you can see installing package pandas this package installs successfully install package pandas and numpy that's done here after that uh, let's uh, click on this run cell and here this is now after or uh, taking few seconds here or uh, this returning the output okay so this is how we can run pandas program inside the pycharm and uh, this is how we can run jupyter notebook inside the pycharm so I hope guys this video is the helpful for you. So now this video is over. So thanks for watching. See you next week. Thank you.